Let's begin with how to use the inhaler. First, shake the inhaler up and down for five seconds. It helps to count 1001, 1002, up to 1005. Next, remove the cap off the bottom of the inhaler. Then put the inhaler into the end of the spacer. Using a spacer helps to slow down the medicine, reduce the size of the medicine particles, increase the amount of medicine that reaches the lungs, and decrease the amount of medicine left in the mouth. Next, breathe in and then all the way out. Using a spacer and mouthpiece requires coordination, so children less than six years of age benefit from using a spacer and mask. Place the mouthpiece of the spacer in the mouth. Make sure to wrap the lips tightly around the mouthpiece. Next, push down on the inhaler once. Now the medicine is inside the spacer. Right away, take a slow, deep breath in and hold your breath for 10 seconds. Make sure to count slowly, 1001, 1002, up to 1010. If the spacer makes a whistling sound, you're breathing in too fast. Slow down. Next, breathe out slowly through the nose. Then, take the spacer out of the mouth. If a second spray of medicine has been prescribed, wait 30 to 60 seconds before repeating all steps. Now let's cover a few helpful tips to maximize success. It is important to prime the inhaler when using it for the first time, or if the inhaler has not been used for two weeks or more. To prime the inhaler, hold it upright with the mouthpiece facing away from you, shake the inhaler gently, then press the canister down firmly and quickly for a short puff. Repeat this procedure again so a total of two puffs are released. The inhaler will then be ready to use. If your inhaler has a counter, make sure to check to see how many doses are left. Always use the spacer. Clean your nose before using an inhaler with spacer and mouthpiece. If taking an inhaled corticosteroid, make sure to rinse your mouth after using the inhaler. Note, the inhaler can be used before eating or before brushing teeth. Now let's finish up by looking at how to clean the spacer and inhaler. Cleaning the spacer once a week will help make sure it performs properly with the inhaler. First, take the spacer apart and then soak it in a bowl of water with a small dime-sized drop of dish soap for 15 minutes. Rinse the pieces in warm running water and let them air dry on a clean towel or dish rack overnight. It is also important to clean the inhaler once a week. First, wash your hands thoroughly. Remove the metal canister from the plastic inhaler container. Do not clean or get the metal canister wet. Remove the cap from the plastic inhaler container. Next, hold one end of the inhaler container under warm running water for 30 seconds. Then, flip the container over and hold the other end under warm running water for 30 seconds. If any hardened material is stuck inside of the inhaler container, use a toothpick to remove it. Shake any excess water off the inhaler container. Then place the clean inhaler container and cap on a clean paper towel to air dry. If you should have questions, please contact your doctor or pharmacist.